Today I'm going to be showing you how to set up Uconomy and your Unturned server with Pine Hosting. All you need to do is select the server you want to work on, click it, then you're going to want to head over to your file manager section. This is assuming you've already installed Uconomy plugin, which you can do through our plugin manager. Then all you have to do is head to servers, unturned, rocket, and then plugins. And then in here you'll see all your plugins. As you can see, I've got Uconomy.dll. And because I've restarted the server once, it has loaded and generated the folder Uconomy. So this is where we're going to be doing all of our work. So just make sure you've got this done. You might need to install the libraries and all of that, which is all done through the plugin manager. Once that's done, head over to the Uconomy folder and you'll see Uconomy.configuration.xml. That's the file you need to work on. Simply click on that file and then this is all the information. So Uconomy is a plugin that uses a database, which in our previous videos, we showed you how to make a database. So a database is like a way of just storing information kind of thing. That's the easiest way to think of it. And all you have to do with Uconomy and a few other plugins is link up the information so the plugin can access that storage and use it kind of thing. So head over to your database. I suggest opening it up in a new tab. And then you'll see here, the first thing we need is database address. So this is the IP. So if you click on the I thing here, you'll see it gives you the IP here. Like discussed in the previous video, the number on the left of the colon is the IP or the database address. So just copy that, paste it over there. Next is database username. So you're gonna just click to copy the username, paste that over there. Next is the password, same with that. And then database name. This is the one that people usually get confused with. It's this, so it doesn't actually show there. You just have to click that, uh, paste that over there. Database table name. So the table name on plugins means you can set it to whatever you want. This is not something you get from us. This you can set to whatever. So I'm going to set this to pine underscore economy. Um, it has to be one word, obviously. And then database port is 3306, which is the same as what we had over here. So we can leave that the same. The rest is all up to you. Initial balance, money symbol, the money name, and the message color. This is all things, obviously, that you set for your own preference. But once that's done, all you need to do is save and then restart your server. Right, once your server's booted, you should notice that there's no errors, which is no red errors, which means we're all good. The plugin loaded fine and it connected to the database fine. That's pretty much it. You can then connect to the server and you should have a balance and everything should be working. Another way to verify is to go into phpMyAdmin and log in and you can check the database here. You'll see now we've got a table called Pine Economy and this has zero rows in it now because no one's played on the server. But if I went and connected, I would get a balance and then I'd be added to a row and it'll be a new row for every player. So that's about it, pretty simple.